got to start my day under a nice bright moon this morning at about 5 o'clock. Now I have a gorgeous sunrise. I love the desert. I'm not trying to... Sorry. Didn't mean to scare you. Oh, is that Dad? Uh-oh. Come in peace. Oh my goodness. until Highway 8, which could take me to Hachita if needed to. Um, they do have Wi-Fi and cold drinks and stuff, um, but I just need service at this point, so I can attend to some affairs that, you know, presented themselves last night. So that's the plan this morning. That's why I got moving so early, so I can try to get all that handled as soon as possible, because it's kind of important. But the sunrise, you guys, oh. Day two is off to a good start. Is there water? Who wants that? Radar, did you bring us water? Yes, Radar. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Owen, oh, buddy. Yes, y'all are awesome. The CDT where bone carcasses mark the trail ahead. See the little marker up there? The white white blades. Well, I mean, this is just a daily thing now. So that's pretty cool. Really, uh, because I used to live in Albuquerque for several years, man, so I knew there was just down the way there. Trail says go here, but my heart says go here. There's a lot of shade under that juniper. Oh, yes. This. Yes. Salvation. There's literally no shade today, so I thought climbing under here would be a great idea. But now I'm second guessing myself because I feel like I just crawled under a widow maker. I guess if it's my time, it's my time, but um, yeah, these bursts of wind are pretty scary. Especially with that large branch that's literally right above me. Mildly freaking out right now because I just literally kicked a rattlesnake. Didn't even see it, so I'm gonna go see if it's still there. <laughs> All right, I see it. I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it. Oh my God, I literally kicked it. What the hell? Oh my God. So there's the trail I came from and there's the rattlesnake I kicked off the trail. So that's cool. Utterly frightening knowing that I have to cowboy camp until Silver City. <laughs> Utterly frightening. Just trying to hide my phone behind my backpack to kind of shield you guys from the wind. It's been a little relentless today. 
but I can't really complain because it really does help with the heat. Um, tomorrow's going to be even worse. The report said like 20 to 30 mile an hour sustained winds and gusts up to 60. So that should be fun, but at least it's not no wind because with the heat, it would just probably be absolutely miserable. Um, but I haven't been able to update you guys. So I'll start off with the tent situation. Um, you know, it was really hard to pitch it last night. Um, so I thought maybe I would, I'd bivy in it, you know, to keep too much dust and stuff off of me or dirt, um, even though I'm dirty, uh, except I can't even get into it. So that's cool. My $600, no, $700, uh, Z packs duplex I only got about 3000 miles out of it and the zippers are corroded shut. So I can't even get into the tent on either door. So um, I did get service at Highway 81. I have a tent coming. It's getting shipped to Silver City to Triple Crown Hostel. I talked to Brennan. He said he'd keep it safe for me until I get there next week. So for now, I'm just going to cowboy camp and um, hope I don't come across a rattlesnake like I did tonight on my walk to camp. That would not be fun at all. Um, so yeah, other updates. Uh, I had another bloody nose. I got heat rash. I have been using chapstick that has no SPF. So I may have lips that look like I use the Kylie Jenner lip kit tomorrow. So if you're wondering, that's what happened. <laughs> um, that's about it. So I'm really excited about heading to Lordsburg. It's always really fun getting your first town. So the excitement is, is still there from starting. And um, yeah, it's been a good time out here on the CDG. Very exciting times. <laughs> I will talk to you guys tomorrow, or maybe not if it's too windy, but I will try to um, just take some video of the trail and stuff like that. So, talk to you guys soon.